Hi, I'm Connor. I'm part of the Mass Digital Tech team, and here in front of me today, I have the Ajax Fire Protect 2, and we're just going to go over a few of the functionality and features of the unit. The first thing you'll notice when you take the Fire Protect 2 out of the box is that it's a different design from the Fire Protect 1. The Fire Protect 1 had the plastic case going around the unit, but in this case you have the middle bit here which allows smoke into the smoke chamber and also a button that you can press to stop the siren which is much more in line with UK fire alarms. The smoke chamber doesn't require regular cleaning and also is a 3-in-1 sensor in this particular version which is the smoke, heat and carbon monoxide sensor. It's also worth noting that there are multiple versions of the Fire Protect 2. So this one I have in front of me is the smoke, heat and carbon monoxide, but you can also just get the smoke and heat version. Keep an eye out because there are also multiple versions coming out with further customization depending on your scenario. So if you just need heat or you just need smoke, they'll be coming out soon. The Fire Protect 2 has an algorithm called the Haze Flow 2 in it, which means that anything that's going into the smoke chamber is analyzed. And if it's recognized as smoke, it will then trigger and do the alarms, but the algorithm will also try and differentiate smoke from vapor or steam, not triggering the alarm and reducing the false notifications. So this Fire Protect also has two other sensors. It has a chemical sensor for carbon monoxide and will tell you if the density of carbon monoxide is high and then trigger the alarm. The other one is two thermistors and that will tell you if there has been a 10 degree rise in temperature in a minute and then trigger the alarm as well. The three detectors combined keep you as safe as possible while minimizing false alarms. For the LED indicators on the Fire Protect 2, they uh, do have different meanings. The red one usually means there's a detection, the yellow one usually means a malfunction, and the green one is good. That means it is either connecting to the hub or powering on will flash around every one minute. Different patterns for the LEDs also mean different things. There's a lot of different things that the LEDs could mean depending on how fast they're blinking. Uh, and it can all be referred to in the user manual for the Fire Protect 2. The different beat patterns for the siren can also be found in the Ajax user manual for the Fire Protect 2 as well. When added to the Ajax app, which requires the hub to connect the Fire Protect 2 to the hub, you can then see the status of the Fire Protect 2 so you can see if the smoke chamber is clear or if there is a high temperature threshold that's been exceeded. And also, if you go into the settings for it, you'll be able to see the device self test so you can make sure that device is working as intended. If you go into the device self-test, you can then start the test, which will then bring up the LED lights, showing that all the LEDs are functional, and a siren noise will also trigger to show that the siren is functional. Once the test has been completed, you will then get a notification from the Ajax app showing you that the hub device is okay with the CO sensor or the smoke chamber, showing that there's no problems with the system. You can add the Fire Protect 2 to the Ajax app, so it can be with the rest of your devices, but kind of unique to the Fire Protect 2 is that it can also be used as a standalone device and doesn't require the Ajax hub to use. But if you do want to have the Fire Protect 2 as an interconnect to the alarm, so if any of the sensors go off, it will then trigger all the other alarms in the building. Uh, you will then have to connect that to the hub. The Fire Protect 2 is compatible with all hubs from the Hub Plus and up. There's two variations for the battery options on the Fire Protect 2. You can either have the sealed battery, which has a life up to 10 years, or the replaceable battery, which has a life up to seven years. Available in black and white, and also in the sealed and replaceable battery versions, all this and more will be in our updated Ajax product catalog, which will be coming soon. Hope you enjoyed the video. Have a good day.